Hey there guys, hope Paul is well. I just want to talk to you today about the channel and how things have been progressing. So, so far I've had a lot of amazing feedback for the podcast and I'm really pleased that you, you all seem to be liking it. And we've been doing really well with this gaming content so I'm going to push for more of that. The last one we did was uh, the Gwent video and although it's not received the same kind of feedback as the Witcher videos, I'm glad that there's a progression with what topic in that you feel comfortable with coming over to the channel for gaming stuff as well as movie reviews and TV. There's lots of big things happening with the channel at the moment. Lots of big things happen in my life as well. Um, me and my partner are moving to our first place, which is really exciting. I'm sure you'll understand that things are all up in the air at the moment. It's a bit of a scary time for us. So please forgive me if videos are up and down, if they're not posted as as often as I have been posting them. I'll try and keep on top of my posting schedule. I keep trying to bring them out. Hopefully I can do some like vloggy videos for you, like before and afters with the new place. Like I say, we're really looking forward to doing a, the house up and making it look really cool. So hopefully that will come across to you and it'll be some new content for you. Another random, uh, another random video for what topic. The channel's really progressed how I wanted it to. So I'm, I'm hoping that all of you guys are loving what I'm doing. I'm basically trying to give you as as a random as possible for the channel and I, I want to do a wide range of subjects just so it's not the same boring content for you. It might be difficult to grow the channel because I'm doing it like this. I don't really want to specify or stick to one type of video for you for content and I'd like to get a lot of collaborators in and you can see what they're all passionate about and really interested in. That's where the grounding for the channel is. And uh, that's my doggy. <laughs> uh, that's where the channel grounding is. It's that I give you the most random content that I can. And it's fun and you can learn new things every day while, by visiting the channel. That's covering gaming. Uh, I posted an art video, I'm really, really passionate about art myself and I've just, like I say, I wanna, don't want to focus too much on one subject, I want to give you loads of random content, hopefully really interesting for you and helpful for all of you and inspiring yourselves to do th channels for yourselves or just get out there. Um, the channel's been a fantastic outlet for me creatively and mood wise as well because I had struggled with my mood a little bit um, and it's nice to have like an outlet and something that is a uh, constant grounding for me. So I just want to say thank you for supporting the channel and thank you for making videos enjoyable to make. I haven't really had any horrible comments from anybody. Um, I've only had constant uh, praise or thanks uh, coming my way. So I'm really pleased that all of you like what I'm doing and feel positive about where the channel's headed. Like I said before, the channel's gonna be a little bit messy with the, the changes that are happening in my life but I'm gonna try and keep on top of everything and hopefully deliver better and better content. I'm hoping that changing places will let me give you better content anyway because I'm working around schedules at the moment and it's difficult to give you as many videos as I'd like to in the week. So I'm gonna try and keep on top of the podcast. I know there's not been one this week, but this is kind of podcast for you in that it's a little bit vloggy but I was going to do a standalone show anyway this week um, not because I couldn't get a guest but um, just I didn't I felt like it was time to talk about the channel and give you an insight into where my head's at with it 
Like I said before, I want to bring a lot of collaborators in. I don't really just want the channel to be about me and I want to show what other people are interested in and better qualified people to talk about subjects than me. Um, we had uh, my friend Phil in to do the science podcast. That was really richly rewarding because he, he's very passionate about a subject that I have a grounding understanding in but n not anything more than that. I have an interest in it but he's a guy that can really talk to you about the inner workings of formulas and, and, and theory into math and science. So it was nice to have his, his input in the podcast. Uh, we had my friend Liam, who is the founder of a gaming channel, gaming brand. And he knows what it's like to talk for his hobby and interact with all of you and gain an audience, which is uh, a, nice, a nice bit of advice from somebody else who's doing the same thing as me and focusing on a subject he's really interested in as well, in gaming. Uh, he was a professional, semi-professional, I'd, I'd say. He played at a pretty high level of CSGO. Um, just a, a really, a really good guy and somebody who is, is really, really at the forefront of new games coming out and trying new games, Twitch streaming and everything that goes along with it. Along with random content I am trying my best to switch up the videos that I'm giving you as well. I'm really focusing on voiceovers at the moment with my gaming channel but I understand the importance of seeing somebody in front of camera's viewership. I'd really like to, like I said before, do collaborations with uh, other other people. I want I want a, a book segment, really, because um, I think that's the only thing that we've not touched on. Um, I'd really like us to have a dedicated person to do book reviews. I can do so much with TV and movies and games uh, but I feel like I'm not a dedicated enough reader to do book reviews. I think that you, there's a almost a level of understanding you have to have with, with reading and digesting books that I just don't have. I, I don't know if it's an attention thing, I just don't have it. I can do it for spells where I'm really interested in a subject matter or I'm really interested in picking a series up and I'll blast through that series but I'm not a constant page churner and I feel like you deserve that, you deserve somebody who's really interested in books and authors and the way people write things and the way that you they break down texts and the way that make th things easy to understand for you and I can see that on screen but it's very different to watch something and break it down than to analyze it in a text format and break it down so I feel like you, you deserve a better person than me to do that. Something that's been in the works for a really long time that I want to have in fruition is my gaming channel. So my gaming channel, I don't know if you know, is Roop Gaming or just Roop. Um, it's a separate channel that is in my channel list and it's predominantly predominantly going to be the two games that I play the most, which is Hearthstone and Gwent. Gwent recently, but Hearthstone is the mainstay. That will be the only pieces of dedicated gaming I would have thought that goes on that channel and I'll probably do gaming reviews to what topic if I'm going to have a breakout game that I look at. That's simply because I want to have what topic as my wow look at this kind of channel and main staples I don't really want on what topic. I want them to be, I want what topic to feel fresh, constantly fresh. 
the gaming channel that I'm doing will be your main stay for the two, two of my most favourite games that I'm playing at the moment. If I have series as dedicated to games where I really get into it, that will go to my Root Gaming channel. But any features, like I say, will be always on this channel. I'm hoping to grow Root Gaming and I hope that that is like a side brand to what topic. That will be more personal to me because I'd like the channel to branch out eventually and it not just be all about me in a vlogging style. Like I say, collaborating with other people. The gaming channel I'm hoping to boost when we get in the new place. Um, I've already delivered the podcast that I said I was going to do. Um, I'm going to look into getting that up on a streaming service so that it doesn't just go to YouTube um, so that we can have a dedicated podcast show. But I do like doing the video podcast for you. Uh, I think that's probably the way forward. And the gaming side, like I say, the, the Root Gaming channel, that I want to push through Twitch and I want to have segments or fun, fun clips, uh, good gameplay, go from one service to another. Um, I know that YouTube has got a little bit strict and I think Twitch has changed their policy a little bit. So I'm going to have a look how we can merge the two. I'm sure it can be done because I've seen many streamers still doing it. So the idea is that you'll have a, a, a live service that you can watch on Twitch and maybe a TV segment, maybe a show on, on Twitch, but I would probably hazard a guess that it'll be majority of gaming stuff. Um, and that will have your clips for Twitch and it'll have your fast audience interaction that I'm looking for. But highlighted games, maybe I'll go on to highlights for YouTube. Um, that's the way that I see it working. And that's how I see a lot of popular streamers do it. I think that's the easiest way. If I feel that I want to break down a deck or I want to break down game mechanics, that will go to my gaming channel. And hopefully we can build that together too. Finally, I'd just like to say thank you for sticking with the channel and massive thank you if you've helped grow the channel. All I can say is that hopefully the future is bright for what topic and it stays fresh, fun and I have lots of random different content coming your way. Hopefully you will always be surprised and hopefully we will build the channel and the quality will go up as each video goes out. I'm still learning as a video creator Sometimes I like going back and watching the raw videos though and it's nice to see how you've progressed but it's nice to see that I'm hopefully talking from a place of honesty for you. Thank you for watching and sticking by me and thank you for everything. I'll see you in the new place and Please have your fingers crossed that it all goes well and the move is easy because I'm stressing out about it at the moment. Thanks a lot guys. Uh, hopefully see you soon. See you in the next one.